Thank you. Right. Okay. So we have the question coming. So for the question, ladies and gentlemen, each candidate has 30 seconds to answer the question. And once you hear this sound, that means time is up. All right. Sealed and protected with that. Sign sealed and delivered straight to us for all the candidates. Wait. Para sure daw na walang ibang makakita talaga. Parang walang lang Alright, alright. Nasaan? <laughs> Wait a minute. Ah, it's hidden in the corner. Gotcha. So this is the final question that we will be asking you for tonight. Are you ready? Yes. Uh, your question is... Thank you, Megan. As a proud Pangasinan, how do you, how can you best introduce your province to first-time tourists visiting the place? Where will you bring them, and what is the best way for them to experience our renowned, worldwide renowned hospitality? Well, if I had the choice to bring them anywhere, I would bring them to my hometown, Bin Valley. I would bring them to the town center, a place of history, culture, and people. We're in the middle of cherry blossoms bloom, and we have the iconic Fountain of Hope, which symbolizes the strength of the people of Bimali during the time of the pandemic. And from there, I would bring you to the ocean and let you enjoy the luxurious view and the beautiful feeling of being behind the beach. And I would, <laughs> and I would bring this aspect. All right, thank you so much. Candidate number three. You had a whole itinerary planned right there. I love it. Anyways, thank you so much, and we'll move on to the next finalist. All right. Here you go, Megan. It's a different question this time. How are you feeling, candidate number 13? I'm very grateful that at we're, we're at last on the top five. It's so fast, very fast. Journey. Yes. Yes. Very fast. Yeah. But you're finally here in the top five and ready for the final question. So you will be given 30 seconds to answer the question, and when you hear this sound, that means that your time is up. Are you ready? All right. Here is your final question. As a proud Pangasinense, how can you best introduce your province to first-time tourists visiting the place? Where will you bring them? And what is the best way for them to experience our world-renowned hospi 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 hospitability? Hospitability. Ako pala yung nag, ano, combo, no? Hospitability. I will showcase them, or I mean, I will bring them to Our Lady of Manawag, aside from my municipality, because I believe that as Pangasinenses, we ourselves are very spiritual and religious. And with the Holy Week, with the recent Holy Week, we can see how devoted we are as Pangasinenses, that we are not just Urduwa, we are resilient and brave. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Candidate number 13. Alright, kamusta ka naman, candidate number 9? I feel extremely grateful that I got to be here in the top 5. Alright, so All right. top 5 na. So you, you will be given 30 seconds to answer this question. And when you hear this sound, that means that your time is up. Alright, your question is, as a proud Pangasinense, how can you best introduce your province for the first time? to tourists visiting the place. Where will you bring them and what's the best way for them to experience our world-renowned hospitality? I will bring them to my very own home here in Lingayen Beach. This has been a place of solace for me. As an advocate of mental health, I believe that Pangasinan is not just a beautiful tourist attraction, but rather a sanctuary for the mind and the soul. And I, that is what I want to share the whole world. How 
beautiful Pangasin is, not just through our eyes, but through our hearts and through our minds. And I believe that I can be Alintas who can to represent this beautiful town and its peaceful heart and mind. Thank you. All right, thank you so much. And at number 18, before we start, do you want to greet your fans, supporters? All right, so you're now in the top five and you will be answering the final question. You have 30 seconds to answer and when you hear this sound, that means your time is up. Are you ready? All right. The question is, as a proud Pangasinense, how can you best introduce your province to first-time tourists visiting the place? Where will you bring them and what's the best way for them to experience our world-renowned hospitality? As a proud Pangasinense, I would want to take our first time tourists, of course, to my home city, which is Ordinato City. And I would bring them to uh, visit our rural areas and be able to appreciate also our city proper. Uh, Ordinato City is, um, has the best of both worlds with the commerce and the rural roots of our people. Thank you. Alright, thank you so much. Candidate 18. Alright, candidate number 16. Before we start, do you want to greet your friends, family, supporters? I would like to greet my family and my couple and hours who travel like two or three hours just to be here. Hi! I hope I'm making you proud right now. I'm sure they're very proud of you. All right, so this is time for your final question and you will be given 30 seconds to answer. When you hear the sound, that means that your time is up. All right, so your question is, as a proud Pangasinense, how can you best introduce your province for the first time tourists visiting the place? Where will you bring them and what's the best way for them to experience our world-renowned hospitality? You know, Pangasinan is my home and I would introduce it to the first time I like it is their home. I would introduce them to the different tourist destinations of our province, the 100 islands of Alaminos, my town, which is Polinao, which how you have seen, which is the wonders of the West. And I will let them taste our local delicacies and of course I will let them feel the warmth of every Pangasinan because we are here to show you that this is your home away from home. Thank you. Alright, thank you so much. Ladies and gentlemen, you're... Alright, grabe, nerve-wracking talaga yung mga moments na yan for our 